On January 19th, Santa Fe District Attorney's Office announced that they would bring charges against Alec Baldwin and Hannah Gutierrez-Reed for the shooting on the set of Baldwin's movie, Rust. In October of 2021, an accident occurred on the set of the movie Rust when Alec Baldwin fired a gun that was accidentally loaded with live rounds instead of blanks and fatally shot cinematographer Helena Hutchins. Both Baldwin and prop assistant ar- slash armorer Gutierrez Reed were charged with two counts of involuntary manslaughter. These charges carry a sentence of 18 months to five years. DA Mary Carmack Altways stated, we're trying to definitely make it clear that everyone's equal under the law, including A-list actors like Alec Baldwin. Baldwin and Gutierrez Reed are set to be charged Tuesday the 31st. Hi, I'm Anthony Collins. I'm here with Jackson Kaler. And we're going to talk about the Alec Baldwin situation. He was just recently charged with involuntary manslaughter. Do you think that's a fair statement to make? I would say so because he didn't mean it and... Unfortunately, the person was killed, so I'd say that's involuntary manslaughter. And what do you think about the sentence they're giving him, 18 months to five years? you think that's fair? Um, I think if it was five years, it would be unfair, but if it was 18 months, it would be pretty fair because he didn't mean it, but he was the one that fired the gun, and it did kill her. So. Hello, I'm Anthony Collins. I'm here with Luke Mazza. We're going to be talking about the Alec Baldwin situation, how he was convicted with on involuntary manslaughter. Do you think that's a fair statement to make? Um, I think it partially is fair, partially is not. I think that it was definitely somebody else's responsibility to know if the gun was loaded. But I think that also carrying the gun and pointing it at people, if you have a gun and you're carrying it and pointing it at people, you should check if it's loaded or not. Do you think um, 18 months to five years is a fair um, sentence for Alec Baldwin? Um, I think maybe less than five years. I think 18 months sounds about right. And what do you think about the prop manager? Do you think he should be investigated or given a larger sentence than Alex Baldwin for loading the gun and everything? Being responsible? I think that he should definitely be given a larger sentence than Alec Baldwin because on the movie said it is his responsibility to make sure the gun's not loaded, and he failed that. I'm here with Devin Patel. Devin, are you familiar with the Alec Baldwin situation? Yes, I am. Um, Are you aware that he was just charged with two counts of involuntary manslaughter? Yes, I did hear that. Um, And the sentence carries uh, 18 months to five years in prison. Do you think that's too harsh or not harsh enough? 18 months to five years? Uh, I think that kind of sounds about right. I think it should be on the lower end of that, though, especially since it was really an accident. And uh, uh, there was no, like, intention behind it. Who do you think is more at fault, Alec Baldwin or the uh, prop manager that loaded the gun with the live rounds? It's probably the prop manager that loaded the gun with, with the live rounds. You're never supposed to do that, I don't think, and that's kind of his fault. Alec Baldwin didn't know that. Mm-hmm. Right. Hi, I'm Anthony Collins. I'm here with... I'm Dylan McKaylee. Nice. Um, what do you think about the um, whole Alec Baldwin situation with the uh, unconvicted manslaughter? I mean... Um, I mean, I mean, on one hand, it's not like he was doing it maliciously, but on the other hand, it, it, it was a very irresponsible action. So there must be, so I mean, there should be, I guess, some punishment, but not something that would, not something that would be akin to the punishment of voluntary murder. But, um, you know, like, I mean, you said that the punishment was somewhere between 18 months and five years. Maybe someone on the lower end of that would be fitting. Um, but still, I guess, I guess something in that case, because it's not like, I mean, it's not, because, you know, he still did something wrong.